Hey guys, Steven is Salon Guy here, and I've been getting a lot of questions from you guys on how to make your hair curly when it's naturally straight. So I'm going to share with you some tips on how to go about doing that. They're not that difficult, but uh, you definitely have to put a little bit of effort into it. So first you want to start out making sure your hair is pretty much wet. So if you take your shower, you wash your hair and you get out, you can towel dry it a little bit just to get the excess moisture out. But what you want to do is you want to take some sort of like a cream, uh, a light gel, um, something that is kind of like a conditioner type consistency, but uh, definitely a cream so it has a little bit of hold to it. Work it through your hands like this, and now what you want to start doing is pretty simple. You want to take your hair, you want to work the product through, and you want to take the hair and scrunch it like this, okay? And what you want to do is just lift from the bottom and squeeze up this way, and you can hold it for a couple of seconds, okay? Now you see what that's doing, it's creating a wave. It's creating a soft, natural kind of wave. If you use a gel, um, you definitely want to use something that's going to hold because what you're going to do from this point on is you're going to let your hair air dry. So as you can see, you're squeezing it up like that and then you're dropping it. And look what happens. It creates and forms a nice wave as you can see here. All right. The key is to using a gel, something that has a light hold and something that's going to help it so it doesn't get frizzy and that's where the cream comes in. Okay, so that's one method you can do. You want to make sure you don't touch it after this and let it air dry. Another way to make your hair curly or wavy is to dry it with a blow dryer, but you want to be really, really cautious that you don't want to uh, make a mess of it. So what you want to do is you can take the hair like this, scrunch it like that, hold it, and then you go over with the blow dryer. Also what you can do is you can grab big clumps of it and you can squeeze it and lift it up as you can see as I'm blow drying it and just hold it there. Uh, that's going to help. You don't want to shake your hair or anything, but just lock it in, squeeze it, and then put the blow dry on it. Just be careful not to uh, burn your scalp when doing this. And the last technique on how you can curl your hair, this is probably the best to do this the night before uh, when you're going to bed. So you can wash your hair, leave it again, towel dry a little bit so it's a little bit wet. And what you can do is take big, big sections like this, uh, and then what you can do is just take your two fingers like this, all right, and wrap the hair around it like that and then make a little circle like that. It's actually called a pin curl. All right, then you can take a clip here and you can clip it in. All right, whatever you have for a clip will help. This is a bit of a larger clip. You can definitely find smaller ones or you can take bigger sections. All right, sleep with your hair like this. I know it might seem weird, but if you guys are looking for that wave or that curl, it's the best way to do it. Then in the morning when you take this out, you're going to have, see this? It has a nice kind of curl like that. And then you can take some sort of gel or something and run your fingers through it and it'll create a nice soft wave and you'll fool everybody into thinking that you've got beautiful, curly, wavy hair. Well guys, thank you so much for watching. I really hope that these tips helped you. Uh, also, don't forget, make sure you have a layered haircut. Having layers in your hair is definitely going to help as far as getting some curl in there because it removes weight. So um, if you have any more questions or tips on different hairstyles, definitely feel free to ask me. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe. So thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time for more tutorials with the Salon Guy.